right, we're going to start out today with our video, like we usually do. Jada needs 17 tickets for a carnival. She already has 10 tickets. How could she find out how many more tickets she needs? She could think of 10 on one 10 frame and then show 7 on the other 10 frame. 10 plus 7 equals 17. Jada needs 18 tickets. She already has 10. How many tickets are we going to drag into the next 10 frame to make 18? Uh, How many do you think? Eight. eight. All right, let's see. So we have 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. 17, 18. You're right. One group of 10 and eight ones. 18. Jada needs eight more tickets. There are eight tickets in the second 10 frame. When eight is added to 10, the answer is 18. 10 plus eight equals 18. Tell a story about this picture. Begin with, Jada has 10 tickets. Use the words, how many more? Okay, who can tell me a story about this picture? Ben. How many tickets does she have to begin with? Okay, so say, Jada has 10 tickets to begin with. Okay. How many more tickets does she need? Nine. How many? Nine, nine right? Because there's nine filled in here to make a total of 19. So Jada has 10 tickets. She needs nine more tickets to make 19 all together. Here is one possible story. Jada has 10 tickets. She needs 19 tickets. How many more tickets does she need? Look at these equations. How are these equations alike? How are they alike? 10, 10, 10. They all have 10. They start with 10. 10, 10, 10. They all have 18. Okay, so 10 plus 7 equals 17. Are these numbers the same? No. 10 plus 8 equals 18. 10 plus 9 equals 19. They all have a plus sign. They all have an equal sign. I hear that too. They're in yes. order. They're in order. Okay, let's see. 7, 8, nine. The equations all begin with 10 and then have some ones added. What does the word sum mean? What does sum mean? add the numbers together. Good. We learned that before. The word sum means the total number of objects in all. Now you know how to make 17, 18, and 19. that I can. Okay, so your paper is going to look like this paper right now. Okay. Well, it's going to look like okay, let's listen. You made 10 prizes for the school carnival. You make 8 more. Use counters to show how many prizes you made in all. Then, write an equation to match the counters and tell how the counters and equation show 10 ones and some more ones. So you have 10 prizes for the school carnival. So how many 
Counters are we going to put in the top 10 frame? 10. 10. So go ahead and make 10 circles or 10 counters in this top 10 frame. We can also write that number in our equation. 10. We have 10. Then you make, how many more did they say that you make? Eight more. So we need to make put eight counters in the next ten frame. So go ahead and drop eight more circles in the next ten frame. And you can write that number in your equation. Ten plus eight equals. How many prizes are there in all? The counters now show how many prizes in all, and now we need to write the sum. 18. 18. 10 plus 8 equals 18. One group of 10 and 8 ones. Make 18. You got that? Alright, turn to the next page. Everyone's on the next page. Okay, turn the page. Here. 
How many how many counters are in the second ten frame? Ten Now this this is a ten frame. It's full, and then this is a ten frame. So how many are in the second ten frame? Count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So there's eight in the second ten frame. So ten plus eight equals how many are there all together? One group of ten and eight ones. Me now. 18, which is a 1 and 8. 18. Now on the next one, we are going to draw the counters. Okay? We're going to draw counters to match the equation. What's the first number in our equation? Ten. I mean, 10. So draw 10 counters in the top 10 frame. And fill that 10 frame in. How many more counters are we going to count in there? Seven. Seven. We're going to put seven more in the bottom ten frame. So put seven in there. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And when you add all of the counters together, you get the sum, which is 17. Ten plus seven equals 17. Make sure your top 10 frames filled in, and the bottom one has seven counters. And then look over at number five. 10 plus 9 equals 19. So we need to fill the top 10 frame with 10. And then, Aiden, how many more do we need to put in the bottom 10 frames? Nine. Nine ones. So then go ahead and put nine. So ten plus nine equals nineteen. Okay, put that written in there. When you are finished, go ahead and turn to the last page so I know you're ready.
All right, number seven. Draw counters and write an equation to show how to make 19. So you're gonna make 19 and number seven. And get started then. We're doing 19. Make sure you write in your equation to show how you made 19. Awesome, now come down to eight. Draw counters and write an equation to show how to make 17. So number eight. Draw your counters and write your equation to show 17. number nine. Draw counters to find the missing number in the equation. So look at where the equal sign is. Your total number of counters is going to be 19. That equals 10 in the first 10 frame plus how many ones in the next one make 19. So think about that when you're drawing your counters and writing the equation. 19 equals 10 plus what? So go ahead and get going on that one. Raise your hand if you need help. 